Okay, so I got Warner Keaton here. I'm Bradley Frith, music instrument specialist at Amaro Music Store. Warner, how are you doing today? I'm doing fine, Bradley. Thank you for having me. Great. So, Pleasure. Warner, I've been pushing really hard for uh, kids and band directors and parents who don't know to be able to have kids be able to play 12 scales in 12 months. Right. And uh, I guess we're going to start this in September. I, uh, I think in September to the next September. Okay. I think this is totally doable for a student to be able to achieve 12 scales. Do you think so? No problem. That should not be a problem at all. Learning 12 scales, I mean, once you learn them, you've learned them. The fingering stays the same. They get used to it. It's almost like a, a pattern that they can follow. And repetition is the most important thing, to do it a little bit every day, I think. That's awesome. And I actually do say that every day. Mm -hmm. Technique plus repetition it's equals repetition. excellence. Yeah, absolutely. So do like, me a favor. Can you play us a scale real I quick? I will. Let's just take, like, for a, for a trumpet player, lots of times they're confused. They, they're, they want to know concert. Now, concert is the scale that you play when you're with the band. Okay. Now, if you're going for all west, they will ask you to play a, the F major scale, and that's for the trumpet. And if you're doing it in band, you'll play the E flat scale, concert. But for us, let's just do the F major scale from F to F. First bass F to fifth line F. It's always the same. <laughs> scale for trumpet E flat concert awesome okay now we'll do a G major scale with one sharp always stays the same some of the scales you want to do two octaves if the range permits um, for the G major scale it's easy to do two octaves because it doesn't take you too high in the register um, another scale that is very common is E flat. Let's do the E flat major scale. And there's 12 major scales and easily recognizable. Let's do a complicated one. Let's do F sharp major. Now that has six sharps. Another one, two sharps. E. A. And for trumpet players, we always need to remember when we're doing C sharp and D, that we, it, we use our third valve slide because the D and the C sharp on the trumpet are high. So we compensate by using the third valve slide on those two notes all the time, especially in slow passages, because we want to be sure. Intonation is so important. If you can play in tune, you sound so much better. If your notes are pinpointed and centered. Warner, thanks so much for spending time with us today. And we'll be seeing you on a couple other videos coming up here soon, okay? Okay, good to talk to you. Thank thanks, you. Bradley.